about a little before 11, and I'm going to do one more exercise. I do my push-ups, I do my sit-ups, I do my pull-ups, I'm resistant training. I want to talk about, maybe about two or three things. Number one, I never, ever, ever have a bad day, ever. I haven't had a bad day in almost these eight years. Uh, some of my secrets. I mostly fruit. My last meal is only 5.36, and I don't eat until 10 o'clock next morning. That means there is no energy on digestion. If there's no energy on digestion, that means all the energy I get back. My breakfast, my first meal of the day is generally 10 o'clock, and that's fruit. That means from 4 a.m. To, to 12, some of course are cage rhythm, I eat mostly fruit. At 6 o'clock I stop eating. That's almost 16, six, 18 hours of um, body rest. That's one of the reasons, my friends, it's almost impossible for me to get sick, almost impossible for me to start aging, almost impossible for me to have aches and pains, almost impossible for me to have a bad day. That's really set my secrets. Number two, I'm very passionate in what I do. I don't survive, I thrive. I don't survive, I thrive. I do what I love. And the other side of it, money's not a factor. I mean, you got to pay your bills. But my main thing is being truth and integrity with my soul of being. I rock and roll. I don't know what you see me good. I got a lot of plants in my house. In my bedroom, I have maybe about 30, 50. About the house, maybe 100, maybe 200. I got 45 raised beds. That's a lot of work. That means I'm passionate. I have loads of energy. I have a lot of work to do. So, so number one, okay? Fruit is the key. Uh, no energy on digestion. Find your passion. Find the love of what you want and you never have to work again. Which means, I found maybe three or four, maybe five passions throughout the day. Number one, I'm a writer. I've written 20 books. I'm always writing. Every day I put out an inspiration. Number two, I do a lot of YouTube videos. I want to spread the word, the vegan message. That fruit is the key. Uh, you stay f you mostly fruit. For the most part, the aging process stops, maybe even reverse. Number three. Get out of your comfort zone and find the love that makes you happy. The money will come. Trust me, the money will come from from different ways. It's been, uh, I would say I started in uh, March, the COVID started. This is uh, November. It's almost eight months. My business is like a roller coaster. Boom, 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 boom. Uh, first was really slow, and then I got somewhat busy, and I got slow. Back to busy again, and uh, I just kind of rolled the punches. I committed myself to uh, being open until at least January. I make it to January. I'm home free for the next 15 years. Hey, what else I want to talk about? Migraine. <laughs> what is a migraine, and how is it to your benefit to have it? I don't know why that word keeps on popping my head. Migraine head. Boom, boom, boom. At least two or three people came to me with talk in the past two days talking about their migraines. Migraines, as most diseases, are love. Everything is love. Basic assumption is the body makes mistakes. The body never makes mistakes. Basic, basic assumption the body doesn't know what it's doing, it always knows what it's doing. We have 75 trillion cells, each shot 24,000 life units. We have 380 trillion viruses in our system. Look that up on Google. We have 60 billion bacteria. They work together in unison to keep you happy. That's it. They work together to keep you happy. It's my opinion, from what I see. If you have a migraine, it means your body detected something which will hurt your brain. Which means, 
and he presses foods with all these chemicals and he meets with all these chemicals, hits the bloodstream, goes up to the brain, it will destroy the brain cells. Body has to protect itself. That, my friend, close the arteries so this toxic material on whatever you eat so it doesn't get to the brain and destroy it. Looks pretty good. I actually have a I have a uh, grow light like back there. I'm growing a five thing. Looks like in some foreign country. I'm not listening. Boom, 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 boom. Let's see what I have here. I don't know. I'm planning. Um, let me see what I'm planning. There's my aloe plants. I get carrots, fig tree, blueberries. I think it's a beet. I'm not sure. This is all just a hobby. I'm ready to do Igasku. Igasku is um, if, um, it's where you lie down and you lie on your back and you have five different levels. I lie on something like this. Boom, 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 boom. I'm a fanatic. What can I say? I'm obsessed with feeling good. I'm obsessed with sharing the, the vegan message. I'm obsessed with looking young. Um, 73 years old, just a spring chicken. And I'm ready to rock and roll, live a dream, super excited. Two events coming up this, this week. Thursday, we're giving out me and Scotty. I think a couple, of, maybe uh, Keith may join us. We'll be giving out free whips and smoothies from 12 to 3. And we'll see what happens afterwards. Uh, well, everyone's invited. Sunday, I'm one of the chefs at a Thanks Living. Uh, sponsor, sponsor my product role. Look for my uh, Facebook ads, Instagram ads. I'll be there. Dave will be there. Karen Ramsey will be there. Uh, Andre will be helping me, and we should have a good time. And that's it. I got. It's almost uh, 11 o'clock. I got to exercise.